Gardendale head coach Chad Ead says this year we'll decide who's really a football player and who's not. I was telling them in an email back uh, back 100 years ago when I played in college, that's how everyone did. We all went home for the summer and, and you found ways to work out on your own. And then the, the, the motivation was to come back and your teammates uh, would comment on whether you look bigger or look stronger. Coach Eads hopes the team can get back together late June at the earliest. With teams not being able to take advantage of the entire summer, Coach says he's aware of players potentially making mistakes on the field early in the upcoming season. Patience, patience, patience right here, LT. The, the defenses are always ahead of the offense. There's, there you, go. you know, just the, the natural timing and the, and the trust in each other that it takes on offense. You know, we're, we're, I think as offensive coaches, we've got to, you know, even more so than normal limit what we're doing. As the weeks go by and stay at home orders continue, Coach Eads wants to make sure we do what health officials are requesting. And we have a member of our team who becomes infected with this and it comes back to our locker room. We're going to lose our football season. Jared Oliver, WVTM 13.